Welcome to my Minecraft 1.8 single player let's play episode number 32. Okay, here we are back again and yes, I'm late today. I know I'm late today. Um, that's because I was playing Euro Truck Simulator. Wow. Yes, I was. I was going south, wasn't I? Yep, I was going this way. I was playing Euro Truck Simulator. I wanted to... It looked, it looked pretty cool, and uh, I wanted Farm Simulator, but I don't think my uh, graphics... Not sure my graphics card would handle Farm Simulator. It said uh, it needed a 8600 or something like that. Mine's only 7200. So, I'm not sure mine would, uh... yep, we're still going the right way. I'm not sure mine would play, would play the farm simulator. I still don't see nothing. Still don't see nothing. So, I, uh, I thought the Euro truck simulator would be nice. Um, and, uh... Oh, when I uh, post this on YouTube, it's going to have a picture in a picture of me. Uh, at least I hope it has a picture in a picture of me. If it doesn't, I'm in trouble. Because that's what I was planning on doing. Hmm. Let's see what it's up here. So anyway, I'm headed back toward the house by a different route that I took to get here. Looking for some different biomes. And... Um, Maybe a village. I really would like to find a village. So, yes, I really would like to find a village. Hopefully, my video card will keep working. I would hate to have to. I mean, my computer's not even a year old. I would hate to have to replace the video card, but I might have to anyway. That general direction. Yep, let's go that general direction. So, yeah, I might have to... I might end up replacing my video card anyway. Um, I don't know. Um, it's hard to say. It's... You know how those... You know how those things go. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. I was I was going to go home, wasn't I? Uh, what am I doing going this way? Oh, well. I'll go... I'll go that direction. Yeah. Let's go this direction. Dum -dum 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 -dum. But, um, anyway, the Euro Truck Simulator is fun. Ah! I missed. I missed that. That certainly wasn't fun. I missed. I thought I could jump over that, and I probably could if I would have been paying attention and look at all these holes. But I wasn't paying attention. And I fell right down in that hole. I jumped. I didn't. Well, let's. I didn't fall right down in that hole. I jumped right down in that hole. Yeah, I did. I jumped right down in that hole. A woof. Woof, woof, woof. Woof, woof. But I thought I would, uh, I thought I'd try the, uh, I'd been, spent a lot of time on Steam today looking through, um, to see what they had. And uh, that was one that I thought I might like that had a demo. Um, I like the ones with demos because I can see if... Oops, that's the wrong way. That was definitely the wrong way, Richard. Why, did I, why was I going that way? I just came all this way over here. 
going around all these big holes in the ground. And I was going completely the wrong way. Completely the wrong way. I gotta go this way. Why did I do that? Yes, I did. I don't know why I did that. Don't know why, don't know how. How did I get turned around like that? I don't know. I always do. Ah, uh, that's the same hole. Well, no, it's not the same hole. That's the hole I fell in. Or this is the hole I fell in. This is the hole I that that was the hole I fell in. Okay. I'm kind of going in the right direction. But I looked at a bunch of them and the Euro Truck Simulator was looked like it would be fun. Okay, well we just came down this way, Richard. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to go around this way. Yeah, I wanted to go around this mountain. That's what I wanted. That's what I was doing. I was going around this mountain. Um, at least I thought I was. That's what I thought I was doing. Whoops. I thought I was going around this mountain. I'm not going that way. That would fall me in a hole. Or that would let me <coughs> fall in a hole. Oh, and I didn't set my timers, so I have no idea. So I have no idea how um, how long it's going to be when I should... Um, Wow, this is a big deal. I still got to go a long ways to get around it. So I have no idea how long this episode is going to be. It might be short because I think I because I'm thinking I would I uh because I don't know when I started and I didn't set my timer and I'm really bad about guessing the time um, this way this way now right this way yep this way this way okay, let's go this way now so what do you guys think this this world really seems to be um, Pretty uh, shabby, I guess. Well, maybe shabby is not the word for it. Um, it doesn't. I mean, I can't find. Is that the same planes? Nope, this is different. Different planes. Here's some more planes. Um, I can't seem to find villages or the uh, savanna biome or jungle biome. There's another plains, but um, is there a village in this plains? No, there's not. So which way do I want to go? That way. We'll go this way. Yep. Yep, this way. So no, there's no, uh, no village, no jungle, no savanna. I haven't found, I found a swamp and uh, extreme hills, um, but I haven't found a village, not a single solitary village, not a single solitary village to be found anywhere, isn't that just crazy, no village at all. Hmm. Look at this. Okay. Um, let's go that way. That's pretty close to the direction of my base, and that should... Yep, we'll go that way. We'll go this way. Watch out for holes in the ground. Oh, this big 
tall grasses. They get in my way. They get in my way. Horses. Horses. But no villages. That's sad. Okay, come on, get up there. So it's not great big. Okay, which way am I looking? I'm looking. Hmm. I want to be looking that way. But let's look around. I don't see no sign of no village, nowhere. Isn't that just peachy keen? Peachy keen? And so that's the direction we want to go once we get down off of here. More forest. Ain't that just great? More forest. Um, how do I get down off of here? How do I get down off of here? Jump down in that water? No, I'm not going to try that. I'll, uh, I'll break my neck for sure. Let's go over here. And go down here. Here. Okay. Now go this way through the forest. Big old chasm here, and how am I going to get across this big old chasm? Um, yeah, I'm not going up that way. No, I'm not. Let's go around here. Let's see if we can get around it this way. Let's see if we can get around it this way. Aha, we made it. We made it around the chasm. So, where are we at on the map now? <coughs> Looks like we're coming up to some water here soon. And, um, okay, water. Water, water everywhere. Okay. Um, hmm. Hmm. Let's, uh, do we want to make a boat? Does that go very far? That might not go very far, but it might go a long way. Yeah, but that's uh, kind of the right direction. Yeah, let's make a boat. Let's make a couple of boats. Okay, let's get this, put it down here. We'll make a couple of boats. Um, put it down. Make a couple of boats. Oops. Okay, we don't have enough. Um, yep. Oh, no, I'm going to need one more, Richard. Oh, I'm going to need one more nap. Okay. There we go, and we'll make two boats. Two boats, can't stack boats. Hmm. 
Okay, can't stack boats. <coughs> okay, let's. Um, I made two boats. So I would have one if one broke. Now, uh, let's put this one. Give me empty out of thing and. Yep. Okay. Um, yes, we can put this down here. How'd that dirt get up there? Don't know how that dirt got up there. Okay. Whoops. Let's put the boat out. Put the boat out, boat out and go that way. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Okay. You know what? This isn't going to work so good. This, that was a waste of time making a boat. But this is a hard navigation, narrow. Narrow, narrow river, and it don't go very far, does it? Let's see. Let's see. Go that way, or go this way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Don't know where I'm going on this river. Don't know where I'm going on this river through the forest. But um, I think it might be faster traveling than by uh, than by walking. Might be, might be, but I wouldn't count on it. I wouldn't count on it. I wouldn't count on us making faster time this way than walking, but you never know. But yeah, I was playing. Uh, Euro Truck Simulator. I wanted, and I the demo, and I wanted to uh, finish the delivery, even though it was late. Um, I'm using the mouse for driving, and it is way too sensitive for driving. I don't know how else to do it, but it is way too sensitive for driving. Are we going to be? Stuck here? It looks like we might be. Wait a minute. Nope. There's. The river's still going. It's still going. Where's it going now? Okay. Yep. Okay. So. We're at the end of the, well, maybe we are, maybe it'll go further. Let's go this way. We're following the river. I figured, what the heck? I haven't done any river travel late, uh, lately, so let's follow the river. And uh, so far, it's, yeah, I'm moving anyway. Don't know if I'm accomplishing anything. I'm showing more of the map. Yeah, my boat hasn't broke yet. Oh, really Ooh. 
there is the cave sound again. You ever open it back up? I still don't see a. Still don't see any villages. Still no villages. Okay, which way do we want to go, Richard? Um, let's go this way. Yep, let's go this way. Yeah. Yeah, we'll go this way. And see how far this river goes before we run out of water. And we have to take to the take to the woods again. Looks like we're almost out of water. Whoa, whoa, nope, 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 nope. Nope, nope, nope. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. More water. More water. I know eventually we're going to run out of Yes, we did. See? I told you we were going to run out of it. And we did. We ran out. Rock, rock Chire. Rock Chire is where we ran out. Okay. Now, how do we get over this glorious mountain? Okay, it's not a glorious mountain. Um, um, let's see. Okay, I think I think we'll go this way. Ah. Okay, let's try it again. Let's try it again, Richard. I keep falling off that little piece there. I get here okay. I get, uh, I, but I missed that one. I keep missing that one. And if I don't, if I don't want to dig it. Okay, we're working on it here. Okay, we're on top. Are we pointed? No, we're pointed in the wrong direction. That's the direction we need to go. Uh, more or less. Yeah, let's let's go over here. See what's up. Hmm. Okay, we're on top of the mountain, and hmm, let's go that way. <coughs> I don't want to go through the swamp, but there's a uh, there's some plains over there, and yeah, let's go that way. Um, yeah, that looks good. We'll go that way. How do we get down from here now? We got up here, now how do we get it down? Um, don't know. Don't know how we get down. Okay, so far so good. So far so good. So far so good. Um, yep, that's the way we want to go. Hey, we made it down. Um, is that the way we wanted to go? 
Yep, that's the way we wanted to go. We're going to go through this little swamp here. Um, let's be careful. Don't want it um, this way, I think, was the way it was. I think this was where it was. Ah! I knew that was going to happen. I just knew that was going to happen. Um, let's see. That way. I think. Or that way. That way. I don't remember which way it was now. Arr. Um, it's that way. I'm pretty sure it's that way. Pretty sure it's this way. Yes, it is this way. Aha. I told you it was this way. I told you it was this way. There's a little bit of planes right here. Um, no village though, still no villages, this world, I swear, I swear this world is just plain rotten, it's just plain rotten to me, there's no, there's no reason why there couldn't be a village around here somewhere, there's a great big hole in the ground. Yes, there is. Yes, there is. We've got to go around this great big hole in the ground. Um, can we get around this great big hole in the ground? Yes, we can. Out of the way, sheep. Yes, we can. We don't want to go down there. There's lava down there. And I'm trying to get... I'm trying to get home. Why do I want to get home? Uh, I got some stuff to, I got some stuff, I got some stuff to want to deliver at home, I'm uh, getting kind of full in my inventory, so I kind of got, I would kind of want to, okay, okay, so I kind of want to, uh, so I kind of want to, Fill this up, or uh, get rid of my, get rid of it. Okay. There's a lot of nice holes I can be exploring. A village, a village. I found a village. By guy, I found a village. And look, look how close. It, well, okay, it ain't close, but. I found a village. Can you believe that? After all this time, going all over the place, I actually I finally found a village. And you know what's usually at villages? You know what's usually near villages? Abandoned mines. Yes, they are. Let's see. Let's see if they've got any carrots or potatoes. There's, aha. They do. We got potatoes. They got potatoes. So now I can have potatoes at home. Good to go. Now let's see, they got any carrots? I see carrots there. Is that the only, is that the only field they got? This is a pretty poor, this is a pretty poor village, isn't it? One little field, well, two little, two little fields, potatoes was all they had. They got no blacksmith. 
I'm going to pillar up over here to get a bird's eye view of the village. And then, okay. Just to make sure that they don't have more than those two little patches of, you know. That's all they've got. It's not much of a village. I'll tell you that. It's not much of a village. They've got a well, a couple of houses, a little tower. <coughs> and a uh, and fields. Um, I bet you there's villagers around too. But hey, it's a village. It is a village. How about that? I found a village. I got me some potatoes now, so now I can get back home and grow potatoes. Uh, wouldn't it be nice if I came across another village on my home? Wouldn't that be awesome? Now, so now I can get back home. That would be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I gotta go that direction to get back home, and it's not really all that far from here. So, hmm. do I want to blaze the path, blaze the trail to my um, yeah, chop down trees, make a road, and tunnel through hills. I might just make a road to my... Let me think about that tonight. I might make a road from my place to this village. Um, hmm. I might just do that. Put a few pieces of... Um, stone and uh what else do i got that i can put in to make a road i got some cobblestone wow why is that up there okay because one of them is a cobblestone but it's gravel i got cobblestone and gravel <laughs> <coughs> so yeah um i might just That looks like it might. I might just do that. I might start going straight for my my own place. I make a road, and then if I ever find a an abandoned mine, I can, have I been that way? Haven't been over that way. There might be more villages over there. Uh, could be, but we're not going to go look. We're going to go home because we want to get rid of these. We want to plant these potatoes at home. <laughs> yes, we do. We want to plant these potatoes, but I'm not going to start that road right now. No. No, no, no. Oops, I'll take my hat off. Ooh, there's no place to put my hat. Oh, yeah, there is. Nope, I'm not going to. Let's see. Is it... There, see the village in the background. I'm not going to. No, 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 no. Uh -uh. No, I'm not going to, what am I not going to do? Uh, I'm not going to start the road today, this episode. Nope. See, I got a couple of villagers, there's even a couple of villagers here. Yeah, we'll have to build some more houses. Or maybe get more villagers. I don't know how you expand villagers. Um, I know you can put a bunch of doors up and they'll start making more baby villagers, but 
I don't want to really do that if you got enough housing for them, something like that. At least that's the way it used to work. Don't know how it works now. But yeah, I'm going to go. I'm going to call this an episode. Um, I'm, it's probably been at least at least 20 minutes, uh, maybe more. And uh, I'm trying in something new. Uh, a picture in a picture. See, wave at you. Hi. Yeah, I'm taking my picture, putting it up, up in the corner while I'm playing. I got to sync. I got to sync my that video up with this video so they match. And uh, so when I'm talking about doing something, I'm actually doing it. Or when I'm doing something, I'm actually talking about doing it. Something like that, anyway. I don't know. I don't know. I gotta sync it up so that um, I'm not gonna have any echoes or anything because I'm using two different uh, two. I my voice my, the voice over is with the little corner inset picture and the other thing that might be troubling is if I talked about something like looking at a map and I'm talking about the map and I'm not looking at the map. I'm talking like I'm looking at the map because when I recorded it, I was looking at the map. But when I edited it together to put the little picture up in the corner and that little picture is going to cover the the microphone and the record button. <laughs> <coughs> I like to put the little picture up in the corner um, with my and my broadcast, but I can't seem to. I'm going to have to download some other uh, broadcasting software, not use the built-in uh, Minecraft software. Which is okay because I kind of like to, uh, I kind of like to broadcast some Euro trucking and uh, see how that, see how that goes. You never know. That might be nifty. Nifty. Okay, so I'm, okay, I was going to say, so I'm old, but I'm not that old. Uh, even when I was growing up, they didn't use nifty. He's cool. Hey, that's cool, man. That's cool. Yep. We did. We was we was cool. And not cool cats either. We was just cool. <laughs> so yeah, I would oh hey, I wanted to I wanted to mention something. Um, somebody meant asked about um Am I always in, in my, in this recliner or couch? Actually, they call it a couch, but it's, it's actually, uh, what it is, is it's a, a, an electric lift chair. And that stands me up, it stands me up to almost a standing position so that I can get from my, from this chair to my wheelchair, my electric wheelchair. Um, I can't use a regular wheelchair because I've got a torn rotor cuff. In my left shoulder, so I can't use a regular wheelchair around the house. I can't walk more than a couple steps. Um, I, I'm down to about let me go, probably five steps now, five or ten steps before my back locks up on me. So I can't walk around much. Yeah, it's not, it's not much fun. I used to, uh, so I'm trying to find things to do to keep me occupied on the computer. I used to. Uh, I used to do all kinds of interesting things. Um, I used to ride motorcycle. I had a couple of different mo motorcycles. I had um, two or three Yamaha 650 twins. I had a Yamaha Virago. I had the BSA 650 uh, Lightning. Um, I, was, I 
I'm not sure if I had any others. I had a home like go uh, kart uh, when I was a kid. Uh, let's see what else. Uh, so I rode a lot of motorcycle. Rode a lot of motorcycles since I was 17 until. Uh, it was probably. Well, it was when I had, when I finally, when the VA screwed up my medications and I got tired of dyskinesia, because it affects my balance, and I was afraid of falling off <laughs> of my motorcycle going down the road. Um, so I, I, had, I had to give it up. I, I mean, I had a backrest, so it didn't hurt my back that much. I had a, an adjustable backrest that, so I could lean, lean back, and it didn't, it didn't hurt my back that much. I could still ride, but, and at the time I could still walk. Oh, probably you know, hundred yards or so. Uh, I could walk to the back of the convenience store from the front, but uh, I couldn't get back. I had trouble getting back to the, to the front from the back. You go back to get something out of the cooler, and by the time I was halfway back to the front, I was like hunched over my cane with both hands, going, uh, taking little bitty, itty bitty steps. It was, uh, yeah. So, uh, uh, that was, yeah, I had to stop doing that. And uh, so I had to stop riding my motorcycle because. Uh, my balance got really bad. I was afraid I'd fall over. I thought about getting a, uh, a, uh, a, a, a trike, but, um, then again, there you have the problem of how do I haul my wheelchair on it? How do I haul my wheelchair? I, I have plans in my head for a, for a trike that I could haul my wheelchair on and I've got a desktop uh, a background on my desktop that has a trike with a that's wheelchair to haul a wheelchair so you know it's possible but my sister talked me out of it she said if you're going to buy something buy something that you can use year-round not just in the summertime so yeah that doesn't sound very you know, so it's not as much fun. I thought, well, I can get a Jeep. I can use a Jeep even if it's raining. But I thought, nah, I can't really use a Jeep if it's raining because I can't, you can't, rain and electric wheelchairs don't go together. I found that out with my very first electric wheelchair. I got caught in a downpour and I mean, blowing wind, thunderstorm. I mean, I had an umbrella and it turned my umbrella inside out. That's how hard the wind was blowing, um, and it shorted out my wheelchair big time. It did. I had to jerry rig that wheelchair. It was just an old one I bought at a uh, at a flea market, but I had to jerry rig that wheelchair to use after then. So no, wheelchairs and water, don't, electric wheelchairs and water don't mix. Uh, a little. A little drizzle, that's okay, as long as you're not in it out, out in it too long. Um, and going from like like the door and into a van, that's okay as long as it don't take a long time to get in the van. Um, basically, you need to protect the controller. <coughs> but anyway, so I decided, well, maybe I can get a, a handicapped van. To haul my wheelchair around in. Well, you have no idea, or maybe you do, how much one of those things cost. I don't see how they, I, I honestly don't see how they sell them because um, I, I really don't. You, you have to be rich though to get one. You literally have to, you have to be rich or be willing to go in debt up to your eyeballs. You know, and, uh, I'm not willing to go into that up to my eyeballs, and 
I'm definitely not rich. I'm on disability and uh, it tight much. No, it ain't. So, yeah, I'm definitely not rich. So I keep I keep scanning, you know, every now and then I'll look at around different websites for uh, a used handicap van. It's not too much. I had one at one time. I had, I had one I liked quite a bit. I, I really, I liked the, it was a Ford Econoline 350, and I really liked the, uh, uh, the way it was laid out and uh, equipped, but um, it was nickel and diamond me to death. I mean, the uh, the it had a bunch of little nitpicky stuff that needed to be fixed. It needed a new uh, ignition switch, not the key switch, but the switch, the ignition switch down on the steering column, down underneath underneath the dash panel. It's got a rod that runs down to it. Well, it needed a new switch because the spring inside was broken. So it wouldn't, you know, when you turn the key and you let go of it, it springs back. Well, turn the key and start it. It, it wouldn't spring back all the way. It came off of the start, so it didn't keep the starter motor running. But it wouldn't come back far enough to where you could then turn it off. Uh, when it came part way back. So I had to take the steering column apart, take the cover off the steering column so I could grab hold of that rod with a pair of near nose vice grips and pull it a little bit, pull it toward me a little bit so that I could turn it off. Yes, I know. I'm rattling on about stuff that really doesn't have anything to do with Minecraft. But anyway, I wanted to tell you because I was talking about, somebody asked about if I always in this wheelchair or this lift chair. And yes, I pretty much always am except when I uh have to go potty or get something to eat. I'm in this chair. I, I sleep in this chair. I eat in this chair. Uh, uh, my sister takes me to the doctor. We load my wheelchair up on a carrier I bought to put on her van. And um, that's about it. Um, every now and then, if the weather's nice, um, in the summertime, she'll load me up in her. Now, in the summertime, I've got a big wheelchair uh, that I can go around outside in that works good outside. And I get in it. I can spend an hour or two in it. So a lot of time in the summertime, I'll get in my big wheelchair and go out and, and go down to the store just to get out of the house. But in the wintertime, I pretty much... In this wheelchair or in this chair unless I'm in the bathroom or in the kitchen getting something to eat and I don't and I try to make those trips at the same time you know uh, so I don't have to get up more than once because it's really uh, yeah it's it's not a pain to get up but it is <laughs> And so, yeah, I sleep here. I pretty much, this is where I live. So that's why I'm trying to find things to do on the computer. And I've been doing Minecraft. I've been reading. Um, and I've been looking at, at Steam to see what kind of games they have available. And like I said, I like Farming Simulator. I forget which one I, I played before some somebody had it or something and I played it and I liked it I wanted but I didn't like it forty dollars worth uh, it didn't, didn't seem like it's worth forty dollars to me but that was on my Xbox and uh, I thought about getting it on the uh, on my computer but uh, it says it needs a a better graphics card than I've got I think I mean, a, a, a GT8600, I think, and I got a GT720. Um, so I'm afraid it wouldn't work. I'm afraid it wouldn't work if I did. And that would really disappoint me because it's like $39.99 or something. Or maybe it's $29.99. I don't know, but it's 
but the truck simulator works. The Euro truck that that works. It's nice. I uh, except my mouse is way too sensitive. I've either got to I, I turned the sensitive sensitivity of the game all the way down, and I'm still running into things because uh, I just barely moved my mouse, and it. And the truck goes like this, you know. I just barely move my mouse, and it, it goes like this. So, yeah, I think I'll, I think I might um, try turning the sensitivity down on my, on my mouse on the, on the computer settings and from the control panel. And my new mic, I, I hope you guys like the sound. Uh, I like it. I've been wearing my headphones pretty much all day because... Uh, the sound is awesome. It, the, uh, for, for the, <coughs> excuse me, for the earphones, the headphones part of it, the sound is awesome. Um, uh, it just, it just awesome. Sounds a whole lot better than the, than the supposedly high definition speakers on my, uh, TV that I use for monitor. Or the, or the speakers on my high-definition TV that I use for a TV. So, yeah, it's uh, these headphones are awesome. I like the sound of them. So, uh, yeah, I definitely know I've been more than 20 minutes now because I've been standing here for probably 10 minutes talking and yakking and just carrying on like a, like a fool. But uh, I hope you like it. I hope you like the sound of uh, better than when I was recording through the uh, webcam mic, but the webcam mic was the only mic I had that worked. Uh, I got another computer mic, but I got it in like 1996, <laughs> and it, 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 it didn't work very good then, <laughs> but I still got it. I still got it. I've got a webcam that I got in, I think, probably the same time. And I'm pretty sure I got the webcam at the same time. A Logitech webcam. I think that mic's a Logitech mic, too. And the webcam still works, but it uh, doesn't have the same resolution as the newer webcams, of course. I mean, come on. It's uh, is it 20 years old. 96, 96, 2006, 16, almost, almost 20 years old, you know, so yeah, <laughs> it's not going to work as well. Can you believe they had webcams 20 years ago? I remember my first cell phone. Matter of fact, I think I still got my first cell phone somewhere. It, it, it wasn't, it wasn't one of the brick ones and it wasn't one of the ones that that came in a suitcase, uh, but it was it was bigger than uh, bigger than they are now. It was about oh half an inch thick, and uh, probably three inches long, and two inches wide, two and a half inches wide, maybe two and a half inches wide, three and a half inches long. It had extendable antenna. Uh, yeah. Uh, that was my first, that was my first cell phone. I think it was a Motorola. And I think I still got it around here somewhere. I wonder if it still works and if it's still, if, <laughs> probably not. I'm sure that the, it's not compatible with any of the networks nowadays. Boy, that sure is, I'm sure tempted to go over there and look at that on the next episode. But no, I'm going to go, I'm going to go that way. I'm going to go home. I'm going to build me a road home. I'm going to start. I'm going to start and I'm going to uh, cut, dig, and chop straight through to home. Um, I might have to make a chest to store some stuff in. Some of the resources I collect, well, like the wood and stuff that I'm going to, because I'm going to end up with a whole ton of wood. I mean, this, this pretty much this whole, 
world so far has been uh, mostly woods and forest. Forest, uh, dome forest, or roof forest, they call it. Um, 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 extreme hills forest, or I think it called extreme forest. I think it was was the biome. But hey, this isn't too far from my from my homestead, and the cows and sheep, and there's horses right over there somewhere. I saw some horses not too far away. So there's cows and sheep. I might I might set up a farm over here. I might just set up a farm over here and let the villagers farm. I wonder if I build a couple more of those same type of farms that they have, if uh, if they would farm them too. I haven't seen them farming this village, or farming this farm, but um, I did in my realm world, if they, I saw them actually harvesting the crops. Only problem was they replanted them all with Wheat. <laughs> they planted, replanted, they replanted all the crops they harvested with wheat instead of what they harvested, which seemed pretty silly to me. But that's it for now. Uh, yeah, uh -huh, sure. I already said that, what, three, four, five times. So goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. And have a nice day. Now I just got to figure out which one of these I'm going to shut off first. I think I'll shut off the uh, broadcast, Twitch broadcast, and then the recording. Yeah, okay, so bye to all you people on Twitch. Have a nice day. And uh, okay, now bye to all you people on uh, YouTube. Yeah, that's it. YouTube. I had to think there for a minute. I can tell you about the time I I uh, I was driving over the road as a semi driver, a truck driver, and uh, you know they have showers and truck stops for truck drivers, but you have to sign up on a on a signing list. And uh, uh, this is how tired I was. I went in to sign up for a shower, and when they asked me my name, I'm like. Uh, my name is, I really, honestly, <laughs> I just, my name just flew right out of my head when they asked me. So, yep. That's why I thought I liked this Euro truck driving. I spent six years in Germany and that's where I started out in this Euro, Euro truck simulator is in Germany. As a matter of fact, I started out in Germ in Nuremberg. And I was stationed in Bamberg, which is near Nuremberg. So yeah, that was that was um, fun. So, and then I I got a load going to my, the load I just delivered was going to Frankfurt AM, and I've been on the A5 to Frankfurt. Um, so yeah, I recognized part of the. The scenery, or not the scenery so much as as the road when I got off into Frankfurt. Um, yep, I've been there, done that. I don't have the t-shirt, but I got a lighter. <laughs> I got a lighter with a crest on it. Okay, so that's it for now, folks. Y'all have a nice day. And... Uh, We'll talk to you again tomorrow.